Hello everyone, welcome to the online class. Myself, Peru Kutu Manisha, working as temporary assistant professor in Raman College of Engineering, Finland. Through this video, we are going to learn about a null scale. Null scale is a port scaling technique used to determine the state of ports on a target system. It exploits a subtle behavior of the DCP protocol by sending TCP packets with no flag sets, hence the term null. A null scan is also similar to Xmas scan and Fin scan in its limitations and response, but it just sends a packet with no flag sets. Null scan and Fin scan types apply the same technique and are also useful against stateless firewalls. A null scan is a series of transmission control protocol packets that contain a sequence number of zero and no set flags. In a null scan, the transmission control protocol packets sent to the target system has all flags as in synchronous, reset, push, acknowledgement, and urgent. It set to zero or null. Normally, when a TCP packet is sent with no flag sets, it would be considered malform, and the target system should respond with a transmission control protocol reset packet. In the production environment, there will never be a transmission control protocol packet that doesn't contain a flag because the null scan does not contain any set flags. It can sometimes penetrate firewalls and edge routers that filter incoming packets with particular flags. The expected result of a null scan on an open port is no response. Since there are no flag sets, the target will not know how to handle the request. It will discard the packet and no reply will be sent. If the port is closed, the target will send an reset packet in response. The null scan relies on the different response generated by the target system transmission control protocol uh, stack for closed, open and filtered ports. First, closed ports. If a port is closed, the target system should respond with the transmission control protocol reset packet indicating that the port is closed and the connection request was not accepted. Second one, Open ports. If a port is open and the target system's TCP stack is compliant, it should not respond at all. This lack of response indicates that the port is open and the connection request was silently blocked. Then the third one is filtered ports. If a port is filtered, uh, that means it is protected by a firewall or some filtering mechanisms. The target system may choose to drop the null packets silently without responding. The lack of response can indicate that the port is either filtered or the target system's transmission control protocol stack is non compliant In the next slide, we are going to see the working of null. TCP packets with no flag sets, that is null packets, are sent to specific ports on the target system. If a port is open, the target sends may respond in different ways. Some systems may respond with an ICMP destination unreachable message indicating that the port is closed. Other systems may simply drop the null packet without responding. 
if a port is closed the target system is expected to respond with the transmission control protocols reset packet this response indicates that the port is closed and the request service is not available then if a port is filtered it means a firewall or other network filtering device is in place the device may drop the null packet without sending any response this makes it difficult to determine if the port is open or closed based on the null scan null scan can be used as a strategy scanning technique since they exploit the behavior of systems that are configured to respond in specific ways to null packets however their effectiveness can vary based on the target systems configuration and network security measures thank you for hearing the lecture